Are you bothered by excess belly fat and don't know how to reduce it? Would you like to eat better to try to lose weight, but you don't know where to start and how to speed up this process? Stay until the end of this video so you don't miss any detail because the fifth tip you didn't know can help you a lot to slim your belly. It is necessary to know that one month is a great period to see good results, a smaller belly, and less swelling. But the weight loss process takes time and it is important to adhere to good habits to keep all the weight lost. But you can rest assured that we will reveal everything you need to do in this period to lose the desired weight and maintain the results. In the first moment, we will pass food tips, and I guarantee that some of them you never heard anywhere, then we will talk briefly about the exercises with special tips that will facilitate the process, so stay until the end of the video not to miss anything. Have you ever noticed that after eating bread, pasta, or even sweets, you get very hungry again shortly after? This happens for several reasons, but mainly because these foods do not contain soluble fiber, which helps a lot in the feeling of satiety. So, this is the first tip, start consuming more soluble fiber, such as flaxseed, oatmeal, wheat germ, broccoli, avocado, apple with peel, chia, banana, orange, lentils, beans, etc. When these fibers reach the stomach, they form a kind of gel, reducing the speed of food digestion and generating a longer-lasting feeling of satiety. Still speaking of the foods that make up your meals, if you photograph your dishes for a week, you will notice that they contain more carbohydrates than proteins. The problem with doing this is that the lack of protein greatly increases your hunger during the day, because when you eat protein foods you release the peptide hormone, which reduces hunger and causes the feeling of satiety, so too little protein equals too much hunger. So have more sources of protein such as eggs, milk, red meat, chicken, and lean fish, among other options in all your dishes, so you will feel less hungry and be more satiated throughout the day. In the same way, you also need to control your carbohydrate intake, understanding that this is the main source of energy used by the body and that it comes from our food. If we put in the body more energy than we consume, inevitably this excess will turn into fat, including belly fat. Therefore, if you want to lose belly fat, you need to reduce the amount of carbohydrates you consume and also think about the quality of these carbohydrates. Have in your meals more fruits, vegetables, roots like sweet potatoes, beets, and other options, which will provide energy and also nutrition for your body. Being directly connected to carbohydrates, the fourth tip is a plea for you to get rid of sugar in your routine. These foods have a lot of empty calories, which are those ingested and transformed into energy, but do not bring nutrients or any vitamins and minerals. Besides increasing belly fat, sugar also unbalances the intestinal flora, causing you to have more gas and a much more inflamed body than normal. Slowly remove the sweets from your diet and replace them with fruits of your choice, because over time you will feel the benefits and this will become easy to maintain. Whenever we talk about losing belly, people think only about fat, but they forget about the factors that lead to swelling and fluid retention. The fifth tip is related to reducing the consumption of sodium in your diet and thus reducing weight and swelling. This happens because sodium is one of the elements that most cause fluid retention, present in salt. It is usually part of the composition of several processed foods, including sweets, sauces and ready-made dishes, hams, sausages, and others that even seem harmless, such as turkey breast, but that favor a lot in the increase of weight and fluid retention. Finally, we have one of the main things you need to do to lose belly fat, but first I ask that you subscribe and leave your like on the video, so this content reaches more people. The sixth tip is, to do some exercise at least three times a week. Exercises such as running, zumba, jumping rope, cycling, brisk walking, and swimming are great for those who want to increase the number of calories burned at the end of a day, and thus signal to the body that it needs to use the belly fat stores which will lead to accelerated weight loss and real fat loss. If you have stayed until this part of the video we will give you a bonus tip that has changed the lives of many people. Below the video we leave a comment fixed with exclusive content, put your best email and watch as soon as possible, take advantage of this opportunity. I hope you have enjoyed this video and that somehow it has helped you, leave your comment telling how many pounds you need to lose weight and what you have done to lose this weight. Until the next video.